Hey, Josh Wagner here, coming to you from Miami Beach still, a couple days after the one day training, and wanted to share a quick story with you about a talk I gave on Sunday morning. So a doctor going through the perfect patient funnel system, seeing great changes, gives two weekends out of the year to teach students uh, technique, TRT, at their university for a full 30 to 40 hours between Friday and Sunday. And he asked me if I could FaceTime into the class of 30 or so students and share from my perspective, especially because he's seen so much benefit in practice. Now, I'm far removed from the student mindset. It's been years and such a change in understanding. And I started by first relating to them, letting them know the hundreds, if not thousands of hours of the Sigur Boost, Reggie Gold, Sid Williams audios I would listen to, all the seminars, all of those philosophy groups, all of those same hours that they're putting in right now for their eventual success and to help people, that I remember those days. But the most important part of the talk, and I asked them afterwards, what was the reception? What did they say? What were they asking you? And they said they were blown away, that no one has came to come to them with that much passion and truth, and they'd never heard anything like that before. So here's the point. I shared with them that I had a lot of the same philosophical understandings and passion for chiropractic. This is one of the more philosophically oriented schools. And I shared with them that what's in here and what's in here that I know is different when it comes to patients than what comes out of my mouth. And what I find is what students are just as much misled as doctors as to the point of education, when education should be done, and why patients aren't accepting care, referring, or keeping on with care. Because it's not that your education isn't good enough, it's not that your scripts aren't strong enough, it's not that you're not doing enough, it's actually the opposite. The more education that you do in the beginning of a relationship, first visit, second visit, before any commitment with care, the further you're actually pushing someone away from wanting to say yes to you, wanting to tell other people about you, fully trusting you, and wanting to stay with you. Because it comes off like you're trying to convince, or sell, or get them to want something that they're not there for. They're not there to become a chiropractic advocate or wellness patient from visit one and two. They're there because they're most likely in pain, they're emotional, they're vulnerable, they're admitting they can't figure this out by themselves. And when you match that communication, when you get in their world, it gives you the chance for them to get in your world. And I'm all for education, but at the right time. And that's through a course of care. That's the table talk. That's talks and events and lectures you may be giving that you're inviting people to. It's not the hour report of findings. It's not the lay lecture they have to come to with the spouse before you give them the recommendations. It's not 20 minutes in a consult or even two minutes in a consult of lecturing them on what a subluxation is. So here's the thing. Being able to hold pretty much two contradictory viewpoints and deliver them effectively, the passion you have, if you even do, it doesn't matter if you do or not, the passion and understanding you have of what chiropractic is, but being able to communicate in a way so patients can hear you. So at some point in the future, hopefully, maybe, they'll be able to really understand, ask you, and absorb what you're trying to get them to understand on the first two visits. It's not happening in the beginning, you use strategy and patient-centered communication in the beginning, watch how much less screenings, marketing money, and marketing time you have to put in to get more new patients over the length of your career. Watch the other videos on this page, get on a webinar, I'll show you exactly how to start a consult, meet me down in a one-day training in Miami Beach, I'll go over this one-on-one -on -one with you, get hone this in you for you to be amazing in your practice and bring that passion to the patient's point of view. Thanks for watching. Stay focused this week.